Hello everyone, this is going to be a quick video showing you how to fix low GP usage resulting in 4 frames per second on Tom Clancy's The Division 2. I sifted around YouTube and through forums for hours trying to find a fix for this and nothing that I could find could help and while there wasn't many having this problem, it's really annoying for the few of us that do and I found the solution, so let's get into it. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake. So as you can see here, I have a Ryzen 9 3900X, 32 gigs of system memory, a 5700 XT, and I am struggling to get even 60 frames per second with VSync off and with FPS limiter off, everything. No matter whether it was on a low preset or ultra preset, it would always put these exact same frames and it would always be 50 to 60 percent gpu usage and about 13 to 20 percent cpu usage i can never never fully utilize my gpu and i tried every fix every possible solution i updated the bios the drivers i made sure everything was up to date and it still resulted in these low frames per second and even though it would be in game would be a consistent 55 or 58 frames per second it still felt really jittery and it made me sick after about two hours of playing i couldn't continue to play the game so if we back out of here and go into settings so in settings we'll set we'll set it to high we'll shut vsync off frame rim, frame rate limit off we'll apply these settings Now, if we go over here into video, uh, I'm running in DirectX 12. I've seen quite a few people say that their system crashes and has some problems with DirectX 12, so play around with it. Mine seems to like DirectX 12, so I'm gonna leave it in DirectX 12, but you can set this down to no and it'll run in DirectX 11 if your system doesn't like it. But the big kicker is this enable reduced latency, reduces input latency, but may cause lower frame rate. If you shut this off and apply it, you can see in the corner there, instant, almost double frames per second. So now, still still on the high preset with VSync off, that's why it says custom. But if we run the benchmark again, and look at that, GPU usage is up towards 90%, seems to be holding pretty solid around that 90%. As you can see, a big difference by just shutting off that one setting. Thank you so much for watching this video. If this fixed your problem, please don't forget to leave a like and leave a comment letting me know that it fixed your problem. Thanks guys. Have a great day.